You work harder and longer than others. You are getting results faster than your colleagues. Many of you will resonate with the term of high performer. Top performers in various fields don't operate like most people. They have distinct habits, routines and systems that make them extraordinarily productive and efficient. Their way of spending weekends also sets them apart. My research on high achievers in diverse areas such as business, entertainment, art and sports revealed that a common practice is a weekend ritual. This ritual includes five specific activities that prime them for peak productivity in the coming week. The best part is that these activities take just 20 to 80 minutes, leaving the rest of the day for relaxing and other enjoyable pursuits with a payoff that is well worth it. Habit 1. Weekly Goal Planning Every day of the weekend, highly effective people dedicate time to establish new goals for the coming week. This quick activity greatly boosts productivity and success. While many set long-term goals, like those spanning a year or more, they often fall short due to a lack of regular action. The solution is to divide these larger goals into smaller, more manageable ones. Think daily, weekly, monthly and quarterly goals. This creates frequent milestones on the path to success. Long-term goals without immediate urgency can lead to procrastination. Setting one to three goals every day of the weekend, however, creates a system of consistent, short-term actions that support long-term ambitions. On weekends, spend a few minutes to define one to three specific and measurable weekly goals, aligning them with your broader monthly, quarterly and yearly objectives. Second habit, organizing your upcoming days. Highly efficient people don't just set goals, they also allocate time each weekend to plan their week. This step brings much needed clarity and structure, helping you know exactly when to tackle specific tasks. It cuts down on confusion, which is crucial for smooth work and keeping procrastination at bay. Planning ensures that you set aside time to accomplish your weekly goals. As Abraham Lincoln said about preparing to chop a tree, the same goes for planning. Time spent preparing is invaluable. I prefer to plot out my week using both a digital and a physical calendar, which helps me stay on track. Without a schedule, I tend to work on less critical tasks, encounter more hurdles and procrastinate more. Clear planning, however, brings structure and enhances my efficiency. An extra tip, dedicate your mornings to your most important tasks without distractions. This approach, which I call eating your veggies first, ensures progress on vital projects and makes the rest of the day smoother. Third habit, reflecting on the past days. Reflecting on the past week's successes and challenges is crucial for increasing effectiveness. I found that spending a few minutes each weekend reflecting on my progress and achievements can save days, even weeks, of effort. This reflection helps identify and eliminate productivity barriers. During these sessions, I ask myself several questions. Did I meet my weekly goals? Why or why not? What contributed most to my successes? What activities or people didn't bring significant results? How could I have been more productive? Which habits benefited my happiness and productivity? What unexpected challenges arose and what can I learn from them? Answering these questions clarifies your priorities and highlights inefficient activities. Identifying what to do more or less of is a major boost to productivity. So. Take a few minutes every weekend to review your previous week. It's a worthwhile investment. Habit 4. Writing your ideas. The practice of journaling offers immense mental clarity by transferring your internal thoughts and ideas onto paper. 
This is especially helpful when internal chatter and worries hamper your focus and productivity. Writing down these thoughts can significantly calm your mind, opening up space for clear thinking, problem solving and creative ideation. I also use journaling to flesh out my ideas, planning next steps and adding structure. Valuable ideas can be incorporated into my weekly plans or goals. I recommend spending at least 15 minutes journaling daily without distractions. You may be surprised by the insights and ideas that emerge. Fifth habit, regular reading. Reading offers a unique opportunity to learn from others' experiences and mistakes, accelerating your progress towards your goals. It boosts productivity and helps in achieving lofty ambitions. This is why individuals like Mark Cuban devote three hours a day to reading. Bill Gates includes it in his nightly routine and Warren Buffett dedicates a significant portion of his day to it. Personally, my success in online business and self-improvement can largely be attributed to reading. Warren Buffett emphasized the importance of reading hundreds of pages daily, likening it to the accumulation of compound interest in knowledge. I strongly recommend making reading a daily habit, but if time constraints arise, especially set aside time for it during weekends. Sixth habit, how to boost focus. Exercise isn't just about staying physically fit. It's also a key habit for mental sharpness and focus. Highly productive people often incorporate some form of physical activity into their daily routine. Even a short workout can significantly boost your energy levels, improve your mood and sharpen your focus for the day's tasks. Whether it's a morning jog, a quick yoga session or a brisk walk, Regular exercise helps clear your mind and prepares you for a productive day. It's not about intense workouts. Even 20 minutes of physical activity can make a big difference in how you feel and work. Seventh habit, mindfulness and meditation. Alongside physical health, mental well-being is crucial for productivity. Many successful people practice mindfulness or meditation to stay centered and calm. Taking time each day, even just five to 10 minutes to meditate, can significantly reduce stress and enhance your focus and decision-making skills. This habit helps in staying grounded, especially during busy or stressful periods. You can start with simple breathing exercises or guided meditations. The key is consistency. By practicing mindfulness regularly, you train your mind to be more present and less reactive, which is essential for maintaining clarity and focus in your work. Take action today. For improved productivity and eventual success, I encourage you to take up these five habits beginning this weekend. Until next time.